year three in the in the offense too with Beck. Yep, year three. I mean, we're going into more not just running plays, but schemes, knowing the schemes, knowing the plays, not just memorizing what we have to do, but knowing what the whole group is doing. Are you going faster? I mean, are, are, is the tempo faster than maybe even what's less Uh I'd say we're, we're still. I mean, we're still installing. It's only practice six, but I think that's the plan. By the time spring's over, to be going even faster. How? how Maybe over the last seven day, seven practices, how's your offense done? I thought we, I think we've done pretty well. I mean, by no chance have we arrived, no chance are we where we want to be. But I think we're making progress towards where we want to be. What do, what do you feel like you got to work on? I think we just have to keep working on not letting little things creep up by us, penalties, turnovers, things like that. I mean, those will kill any offense, but especially us. I mean, we seem to have a tendency to let penalties kill a drive or a turnover kill a drive. So that's something we really got to work on. Talked a little bit about the continuity that you guys have as an offensive line because you're all you know older guys who've been playing together forever. How much easier does that does that make you? Yeah. I mean, it does, I wouldn't say it makes it easier, but one thing like I was saying there is we know that if someone messes up, it's not a personal attack on the other one to hey get your stuff together, let's go. I mean, it's it's we know we want to be the best, and no matter what happens on this field, we're going to come off the field and be best friends. Again. So I mean, I think that's what makes it easier as far as being good cohesive friends on the line. Does that open up you know? the communication you guys have, does that open up opportunities to maybe make some more line shifts and do some more audibles between you guys as a line? Yeah, I mean, knowing there? what the other person's thinking is huge because, I mean, you all five of you have to be on the same page in order to be able to execute something right. So if we know, we if I hear someone on the far side make a call, I'm going to trust them it's the right call and I'm going to come with it. And if someone hears me make a call on the far side, they're going to trust me that it's the right call. And that's the kind of thing we all trust each other, which is huge. Okay. I got a quick question about a guy who's not necessarily at your position, but kind of he's, he's sharing the backfield with you guys. Uh, CJ Zimmer, what have you seen from him this spring? I mean, he, he really kind of seemed to come on at the end of last year. Is that yeah, he's having a great spring. I mean, I, he's one of my good friends, too. He's Cole's roommate. Uh, we've all been here together for five years now, and I think he's probably having the best spring I've seen him since he's been here. He's being physical. He looks like he got a lot stronger this offseason, and he's just he's turned into a really, really good fullback for our system.